It makes me so happy to finally be filming this. There's like, oh boy, oh boy. All right, let's do this. Hey, hey, you guys, what is up? Today I am going to be filming one of my most popular videos. It seems that my hauls just always get you guys, and I get so many tweets about how when I post these, you guys are like, I need to go shopping, like, I need to find that, like, so it makes me so happy. So today I am filming spring clothes. Now, I will probably be doing two of these. There's a reason. The first reason, basically what you see behind me is what I will be taking with me on vacation. And if you guys don't follow me on Twitter, just putting it out there. Uh, I am going on vacation for my parents 25th wedding anniversary. We are going on a cruise to the Caribbean and we're going to be going to St. Thomas, St. Martin and to the Bahamas. I am so excited and that meant I got to go shopping because I like, lost so much weight that I was trying everything on from last summer and I'm like nothing fits me. So took everything to Plato's and consignment, got some money back and this is what's happened. I have so many clothes. Now, uh, I think there was a second reason. Yes, there was. Second reason. I probably will be doing a second video because I will probably continue to buy things, but this is basically everything I'm going to be taking on vacation with me. There are a few items that I have back at home that I'm so mad that I don't have in this haul because they are such cute pieces. Oh, I can't even tell you guys. They're so cute, but I'll probably show those in my next haul or when I film a lookbook probably when I'm on vacation and stuff like that. You guys will see them. So anyway, enough rambling. There is a quite a few patterns in this video though, I'm noticing. Like when I like looked at what I had, there's a lot of peach as the shirt I'm wearing right now is peach. There's a lot of rompers and a lot of kimonos. So, just throwing it out there, there's a lot of those items in here, but they're such cute pieces. Everything is pretty relevant. You might be able to still find quite a bit of these. I know a few of these pieces are from boutiques, so those that you might not be able to find, I will link those boutiques down below. But yeah, everything else you pretty much should be able to find right now. And I will be showing you guys what they look at me, as I always do with these lookbooks, or try on hauls, I guess you could say. I call them like mini lookbooks, try on hauls kind of things, because I feel like you guys get a better sense of what it actually looks like on. So yeah, I'm done rambling. Let's get to clothing. I have wanted a pair of origami skirt, skirt shorts, whatever, for God knows how long. And they had them on Daily Look, and I never bought them because I didn't know if I could fit in them. And they had a pair at Express, and I gobbled those little sons of guns up, and I'm obsessed. I bought a origami skirt. It's leather, which makes it even cooler. Oh, God. Anything leather is, like, right up my alley. So, yeah, it's one of the, it's like a skirt, or it's like, it's shorts, but then it has, like, the origami flap on the front. I love these. They're super cool. You can still get them at Express. I know these ones I got on sale. I was actually going to pay full price and then the lady was like, you need to go check the sale rack and I'm like, okay, done. So pick these bad boys up. I'm obsessed. They are so comfortable. So great for going out. I cannot wear, wait to wear these on the cruise. Ugh, I'm so stuffed up. Ugh, the struggle is real. Ugh. Okay, I'm done complaining now. I get bored, so that song is still my grown on me. I don't care what anyone says. I actually bought this last summer at the end of it so it's kind of irrelevant to the whole like hey this stuff is still available but I love this jacket so much and I didn't get to show it to you guys that I'm pretty much obsessed with it and it's this white jacket and it has these awesome sleeves and they're like all cut out and everything and there's just so much detail on it and it's so simple I'm obsessed with it like I truly am I got this from Kohl's from the apartment 9 collection loves it love love loves it I'm totes about to do another social media blast, so if you guys aren't following me on Snapchat, follow. I bought this, I showed this dress, and I was like, this is my princess dress. Like, I know it's not like the big ball gown, but I'm like, if I was a princess, I would rock this. I would rock this sucker all the time. And I got it at TJ Maxx, and it's this beautiful pink. It's a T-length dress. I, oh, can we just... Can we just take a moment? Got it um, from TJ Maxx's French collection. Um, it was a little expensive, it was $50, but I needed a nice formal dress for the cruise, so I'm going to be rocking this so hard. 
I'm obsessed. It's so beautiful. The back is a V. I love it. I look like a princess in it. Yay! So, so, so obsessed. This is like a short dress I have, and then it moves on to like rompers and maxis and stuff like that. Um, but shout out to my absolute favorite boutique ever, Athalia's in Midland. I'm obsessed with you guys, and literally you guys sucker me into everything that you have in there. If I literally had a million dollars, I would literally go buy everything in that store. It's, oh, I just love it. So I got this dress, and it's like, it's just like a t-shirt kind of, and then the bottom it's all fringed, and then in the back it is, um, crossed everything. I just loved it. When I put it on, I was like, I'm going to rock some booties with this and a big hat, maybe a flower crown or something like that. Just totally my bohemian side. Oh my gosh. I just, I envisioned it and I'm like, I will rock this. I will rock it. Rompers. So many rompers. Obsessing over rompers. Literally, Words cannot describe how much I love a good romper. I cannot even tell you guys. They're great. I mean, there's literally, there. everyone can rock a romper, I feel like. So, um, I am literally obsessed. I got this one, the first one, which is so cool. I totally just dropped that. Huh. Got this one at Nordstrom Rack, and I love the long sleeves on it. It's great for those kind of chillier nights on the boat. Um, obviously, romper. Love the Aztec print on it. Super cool. I feel like I'm totally going to rock it. Where are they at? I'm like, oh good, over there. Totally gonna rock this with my report signature heels. Obsessed. Because those are tan and I can pull the tan off with the colors in this. Obsessing! I feel like that's another trend of this video. I'm going to say obsessing a lot. My bad. Let's do an obsessing count. If someone wants to start that up right now, that'd be great. Got this romper from Urban Outfitters. Cole and I went in there and I bought this romper. Super, super cute. Cream base floral pattern, love it. Little ruffle bottoms. I just think it's really cute. Something simple if we're off sh on shore one day or whatever. And then this I love too. I feel like this is gonna be a good travel outfit for me. Um, it's like the t-shirt material, black and white, big floppy hat with some combat boots or something like that. Love that. And then I got a another peachy romper. Told you guys, peach is a massive theme in this haul just love the crisscross back in it it's just one of those really good easy throw on like if I need to go do something real quick or something like run to the store I don't know I'm all about easy good but still looking good kind of stuff literally hate that song I don't know why I'm singing it if I like says my people that are living below me are like this girl can't sing I know I can't it's stuffed up give me a break I can't sing anyway so it doesn't really matter Now we're on to kimonos, and I have three of them. The first one I got, once again, at Athalia's. Sup, guys? Love you. Um, I got this, and it's this super cool, like, snake skin, and it's super long, and oh, I just love this. It's so unique. I'm not a big fan of snake skin. Don't know why I love my animal prints, but snake skin is not one of them. But I just saw this, and I'm like, yeah, this is really cool. I posted a picture of me on it, me in it on Snapchat, and I just am obsessed with the coloring in it. I don't know why. Next up, TJ Maxx, black kimono with all, like, black beading. I just thought this was really cool. I haven't worn it yet um, because I just, like, I look at it and I put it on and I'm like, I just want to save this. I don't even know what for. But, yeah, I think this will be cool, like, with, like, a um, just a dress or some. Like, if I put, like, a white t-shirt on some jeans or um, denim jeans, denim jean shorts, meh, I can't even talk, and, like, throw this over to, like, spice it up kind of thing, yeah, I think, uh, I think I'll be able to rock it that way. And then this last one is from Target. Super, super bright, black base, all fun, colorful feathers, and then some fringe on the bottom. Super cool. Found this. I think it was on clearance or something. And I was kind of like, this is kind of weird because this is a totally in piece right now. I don't understand why it's like already, but like already on clearance, but whatever. I bought it and snagged it, and it's mine now. Wee! I'm trying so hard to make sure my video is not like 35,000 minutes long because I like to talk. But I want to make sure I'm not like talking everyone's ear off. Ugh, the struggle is real, you guys. I feel like my bloopers are going to be so long, though. <laughs> Sorry, I feel like these bloopers are gonna be longer than my actual video. What else? Haters gonna hate. Haters gonna hate, 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 hate. Haters gonna hate, haters gonna hate. Haters gonna hate. Name that movie. Seriously though, if you guys just did name that movie and you got it right, you guys are totally impressive. The interview. Next up, I have some long sleeve shirts and Michigan weather. <sighs> We have like all four seasons in one day, 
So I try and make sure that I do have some long sleeve pieces that are still light enough, but still, you know, kind of warm enough. So, and I do work in an office during the summer, so it gets kind of cold. I got this piece um, at TJ Maxx. It is a peach creamy color and just long sleeves. The back is cut out. I just really like it. I thought it was really, really cool. I wore it one day with some white jeans and I loved it. It was super comfortable, super like nice and it just fit good and everything. This is another piece from TJ Maxx and they have this in white but I didn't like it as much because I'm like I already have a lot of white shirts and I wanted something fun. So it's like, okay, <laughs> here it is and then it is a crop top but it has like those super long sleeves on it and it's all fringe. I just thought this would be really cool with some jean shorts and like high waisted ones and some like cute sandals or combat boots. I don't know my grunge bohemian look trying to mesh together but obsessed and I love the color of it super fun and then from H&M I picked up this green sea foam mint color and it's just I kind of like was picturing this more as like instead of like a shirt but more as like cover up or something like when I'm on the boat and again like because the back is oh this is my favorite part I love this back I thought putting like a bandeau top with it uh, like one of those lace ones that like you know the halter and whatever I thought that'd be really really fun just for late night going to the pizza bar and get ice cream because vacation YOLO <laughs> next up is my short sleeve slash like spaghetti strap shirts and whatnot this piece I wanted for so long and I am the kind of person that when I go to TJ Maxx if I see it I usually just get it because I know it's not going to be there but I passed up on this because it was kind of expensive. It was originally $50 and then I was like ooh can't afford that for a shirt like for reals okay. So it's this <laughs> it's this beaded crop top. It's so beautiful. I mean it's heavy though that's the bad side. It's very heavy but it's lined and it's not itchy or anything because it is beaded and whatever. Found it on the clearance rack. I couldn't pass it up. I was like this is meant to be and it's just so beautiful like I'm so excited to wear this and like maybe like pair it with my leather shorts oh gonna be rocking it ooh 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 kill him boom another crop top JLo Jenny from the block this is from her Kohl's line just something fun maybe I'm gonna pair it with a like uh, maxi skirt or something like that so super fun and then I just picked this piece up because I had a job interview today ah super excited because I don't literally just talk to a camera for a living. I wish I did. That'd be really cool. But no, I I wanted to get a job. I currently just am an intern for my mom and she will send me things to my computer. Be like, will you help me with this? And I'm like, yep, send it back to her. I sometimes get paid for it. I do a lot of like consignment if stuff like if I'm like, I don't even need this day to consignment, like I make money that way. But I work enough during the summer, luckily, that I save up enough that I do myself, like, I give myself a certain allowance, so, little fun fact for you guys. But, I found out that Athalia's, my, like, one of my favorite boutiques that my friend introduced me to, was hiring, so I'm like, oh, why not, seriously. So, and I tweeted that I had a job interview today, and I'm not kidding you, like, okay, we're gonna get a little sappy here. The amount of people that tweeted me and texted me saying good luck today especially my subscribers I mean my friends like you guys are legit you guys are my friends like duh but my subscribers I had so many of you guys saying good luck you look great all these kind words it just like made me I don't even like calling you subscribers anymore like feel like you guys are just friends and family and it made me feel so good and I actually got um, told that I was gonna get a second call for next weekend so we Easter weekend I think which kind of sucks but if it's you know gonna happen my parents will understand to get a second interview with the owner so I want to thank you guys so much for all your positive vibes uh, towards that that was really great I was in there I had to do a little shopping because it's really so cute and I picked up this bandeaued like it's like a tank top and then it has a built-in bandeau in it and I'm a, truly obsessed I saw this on their Instagram I will link all their social medias down below because you guys need to check them out but yeah it's just so cute I told you guys this peach color is my oh, obsessing so yeah pick this up it was a little more expensive I think it was it was 34 it was a little expensive but I find pieces like this and they're unusual and trendy and stylish and not a lot of people have them so I'm like I gotta pick it up because I like to be unique so yeah yay oops I don't slide to you guys I do have another short dress but it just was not in the right area I bought this I'm in love with it I now that I've oh, I just like 
I've lost so much weight that it's like my pride and joy, basically. I probably talk way too much about losing weight, but I it's, it's one of my biggest accomplishments. But yeah, so I bought this dress, it's a bodycon dress. Hated bodycon dresses, by the way, but now that my stomach has flattened out and everything, and I can rock it, I got myself a booty a little bit. Picked this up, this is from the Jennifer Lopez line too. Loved the blue color, thought it was so fun, especially for a vacation. The bag has just the strap and everything, and it's, I want to say this is more like a mini dress, but it's still a bodycon, short bodycon, but it's kind of a midi. Yeah, I'm totally obsessed with this color. I think it's going to be so cool for the cruise. Now we are on to the true addiction, and that is jumpsuits, ah, rompers, not even like like long, long legged rompers, jumpsuits. I am a massive fan. Seriously, you guys. So, the first one, there's actually a maxi dress in here, but it's long, so that's why it's with this. This first one I got is from Free People, and it I got it actually at Nordstrom Rack, but I love the material of it. It's like a really, really soft cloth. I want to actually find out what it is. I'll have it listed down below. But I just love kind of the darker color, chilling on the boat kind of thing. Pair it with some sandals. Totally, totally obsessed. There goes that word again. Dang it. Gosh. Just an addiction. This next, oh my gosh, I can't even tell you guys how awesome this thing is. I was in Target and I was like, dang, you would totally rock that. And it's this jumper, long jumpsuit, jumper, jumpsuit, romper. What do you guys want to call these? Okay. Anyway, so high neckline, beautiful peach color. I'm not a big fan of these waistbands, but I got past it. And it's just long, and it's so beautiful. Once again, I posted a photo of me wearing this on Snapchat, and I was like, 67 days till paradise, and oh, so excited. But yeah, it was only $30, and then I had like a the cartwheel coupon or something like that. So I just love this. I think it's going to be awesome, awesome for like if there's a dinner, and I don't want to totally get dressed up, but I still want to rock something that I'm going to look good in. Do you feel me? Do you feel me? Mm-mm. I feel like I need a choir behind me saying, do you feel it? Do you feel it? And then the last long dress jumper that I have is also from Jennifer Lopez. And it is this beautiful emerald green dress, high, high neckline again, just a few cutouts in the front and the back. And it was just so beautiful. I think I got this super, super cheap. Yeah, $16. You can literally not beat that. And I've been told I look really good in emerald because of my blonde hair. So yeah, and I've always kind of wanted a emerald green dress. I also want a emerald green purse, but I will settle for the dress right now. Okay, well, <laughs> this next part of the haul is not going to be try on. And if any guys out there are watching, I'm sorry to burst your bubble, but I have swimsuits and cover-ups. Yeah, I'm not going to be trying these on, I'm sorry. <laughs> You guys just lucked out, <laughs> my bad. But I just, that's not appropriate. I feel like you guys don't need to be seeing more of me than what you already see right now. Little background, um, I really, I, okay, I set a goal for myself that if I lost 30 pounds and really slimmed down, and even if I was like close to the 30 pounds and like really slimmed down, I was going to treat myself to a triangle bikini. I want the one so bad, I want the, your or it's the it's the black leather one it's like the it starts with an M and then it's like the the New York New York or something it's it is a dream oh I want it so bad but I am only seven pounds away from that but I did need new bathing suits really bad and I had just found these ones just in case I didn't reach that because I am sticking to it I'm not buying it early I'm not buying it later I it will happen. But anyway, I actually found this bathing suit and it's kind of that same neoprene material that it's made out of the triangle ones and it's just kind of fun and sporty and yeah, it's from Target from the Exhilaration line. The next one is from Victoria's Secret. These are actually two separate pieces. I was at the Great Lakes Crossing outlet in Auburn Hills and they had their $10 pieces. I'm like, oh, I, gotta pay. I can't pass that up. So I got this really fun uh, neon green with the blue straps and then I just got a cute little bottom that matched the neon in it so I'm gonna put those together and then I found this is really cool it's a tad big on me but I'm like totally don't even care I'm calling it my mermaid top look how cool this is can we just I'll do a close-up and everything but it's all sequins super cute I feel like this is something that a bride would wear on her honeymoon but 
it reminded me of a mermaid and I want to be a mermaid so that was my excuse to buy it and it's super cute and then lastly I picked up a cover-up and I'm usually not one to like really buy cover-ups because I'm like hey shorts and tank like let's do this let's go down to the pool but I saw this and I was like Carly Christman would hate me if I didn't buy this and it's this beautiful white like I don't know it's kind of like a dress it's not very long it's not very short either all beaded I mean the detail on this is phenomenal and I got this at Burlington Coat Factory totally random I know and it's by Novia Beach super cute super obsessed I'll do a close-up of the detailing on this but yeah so so obsessed and the last few things that I have are accessories now I didn't buy a ton of accessories because I'm not really big on accessories I have like one pair of earrings that I wear I have a hat that I wear but yeah I saw I really wanted a Panama hat so bad and I was going to buy the one from J Crew to like buy it because I loved it so much but then I randomly found this one laying around Forever 21 seven bucks can't beat it I think I'm wearing it the right way that would be really awkward if I put it on wrong but yeah it's just fun I don't know my mom doesn't like it but when I was in Forever 21 I had it on a few people walked by and they're like that looks cute on you and I'm like there it's time from God sorry mom you're overruled but yeah, I just thought this would be really cute, especially with like one of my rompers that I have. So yeah. I look so festive. And so beach and cruise ready. Take me to the beach. Ah, we're sh just kidding. We're gonna have to start sick walk here. Just kidding. Dollar. Yep. Each one of these is a dollar. So I just got tons of them. I got ones with like the peacock feathers and tribal and more of the henna inspired. I think, oh, there's two of these ones, but the ones like with silver and gold, ones with just gold. So I was like, these are going to be so cool to have when I'm on vacation, just rocking them. I think they're so pretty. I might put some on for like dinners and stuff like that. So if you guys are looking for some temporary tattoos, Walmart has them for a dollar. They're in the jewelry section, and I believe that they are next to like where all the bridal stuff is, which is kind of weird, but that's where they're at my Walmart. But just look in the jewelry section. They got tons of these. And the last two things I have to show you guys, I got from Rue 21. And I don't even know, I think Cole and I just went in there on a whim or something like that because I really don't shop there. Um, but I was looking at their jewelry and I found, these looks really weird, you guys won't probably see them. I found two body chains and I think they're super cool, uh, especially like when you have maxi dresses and I don't know, I'm just obsessed with this. So this one, ah, let's see if I can do this. Um, that one just looks like that and it just lays down. And then it's all in the bag. These were cool. They were only a dollar. And I was like, these are such a popular item right now. Oh my gosh, I'm stuck. Oh, I'm stuck. Save me. But these are like such a popular item right now. I'm like, these are really cool. And if they break, they break. I mean, I didn't pay a ton of money. And then the other one, um, that one was gold. And then this one is silver. And this has a dream catcher on it. So I thought these were just super cool. This one, um, this one just goes around your neck and then goes around your waist. So it's just like a... Uh, hourglass so yeah I just thought these were super super cool and I can you know dress them up dress them down they're fun accessories to have and they're super lightweight and they were super cheap so yeah so that is it you guys I hope you enjoyed hopefully this didn't run too long because you guys know how much I like to talk but I don't do hauls all that often so I feel like when they're longer like that's okay because I know some people do like three or four hauls and I'm like we're gonna do one so it doesn't look like I have a problem but I do have a problem, let's get real. If you guys like these kinds of videos, leave me a comment below or give this video a big thumbs up. If you guys want to see uh, some more videos of your choice, leave me comments below. I always love hearing what you guys want to see on my channel. I'm going to be doing a few more workout videos. I saw how much you guys loved those. I will have um, my past videos linked down below, including my We The Kings concert vlog, which is super cool. So I'm going to be CTFXers, DLVers out there. You guys like We The Kings, Charles Trippy, yay. Watch that. I also have my worst date ever video. You guys seriously have no idea how funny the comments I'm getting on that video are and the tweets and texts. Oh my gosh, you guys are just great. Like my friends always are texting me like, yep, good job. Okay, so I'll have that all linked down below. All my social media is every else, every else thing that I mentioned in this video, I'll have linked down below. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.